Hi guys, it's your girl Jess. If you're new here, my name is Jess. I do makeup, anything related with beauty in general. This is what we do in this channel. So before I even start, I want to say thank you to all of my supporters. If you've been supporting me for a long time, I want to thank you so much. Thank you for the love and I appreciate you guys so much. So for today's video, I wanted to do basically an eyeball tutorial on like show you guys how I do my eyeball everyday basically eyeballs using um some product that i bought so the first thing will be the i don't know what you guys use but i personally like to use the elf cosmetics which is the shade espresso basically it's like a dark brown not too dark i guess and i have been using it for a long time and I also have the pencil, but I like to use this one better. I like it better. So I'm going to show you guys basically everything that I do. So to begin with, we're going to be taking our product, which is the pomade. And I usually like to put a little bit out, like on the top. Basically the, the, the lid. I like to put a little bit of the product. It's easier for me just to get it out with the brush and we're gonna be taking our fluffy brush which is also from elf cosmetics it's called the it's a large wall win one i guess yeah elf cosmetics and first thing i like to do is to basically um wash my eyeball a little bit basically just have to follow the shape um, what I'm gonna do today, I'm just gonna do one and then after I'll show you guys both when the when the ready And yeah, I'm just gonna do this one and then I'll show you guys the other one just off camera I'll show you both after on how they look So after I brush my eyeballs, um I'm gonna be taking my This brush it's like a flat like two-sided brush this one is from morphe with the collaboration with jeffree star cosmetics i don't know if you guys know who is he but yeah um i'm gonna be taking this side basically because i've already used this one i'm gonna take this side and i'm gonna be taking my elf cosmetic pomade and like I said, guys, this is the shade Expresso, if you're wondering. So, I'm going to take the product out of it a little bit. First thing you want to do, you want to make sure that you follow the actual shape of your eyeballs. Because you don't want to mess up the actual shape. So, I'm just going to follow the shape. I like to line it over a little bit more so hope you guys see I'm actually following the shape like everything and you just gotta fill it in Okay, now we're gonna be just gonna be shading the inside just by following the actual shape. And now we're gonna do the top one the same way that we did the bottom.
you guys see how easy that was okay so right now we're just gonna be taking our concealer um i'm gonna be taking my juvis place foundation i use this one has a foundation and concealer at the same time and this is the shade somalia 350 if you guys aren't i'm just gonna take a little bit out of it and i'm gonna place this concealer basically on the bottom i kind of used i like to use two different concealers like the darker one for the bottom and like a lighter shade for the top one so i'm just gonna conceal the eyeball You guys see how it looks like with the concealer on it? I mean, you could use both. Like, you could use one concealer for both, like the top and bottom. But I like to use two different colors. Because I feel like it looks more natural to me. So now, I'm going to be taking my other concealer. Which is the lighter one. It's a little lighter than this one. Which is the um, Rhyme of London. And this is the shade. Where is the number? Okay. Um, Golden Ember 532. I'm going to be taking a little bit out. And use it for the top. Okay, so now I'm going to be taking my brush. Um, I'm going to be using my two different kind of brushes. The first one is the this one. It's from Emacs Design. I think I bought this one from Amazon. I don't really remember. So I'm just going to use these brushes to blend out everything. You can use any kind of brush that you have. It doesn't really have to be a specific one as long as it's, as long as it does help you to get the ball looking good okay you guys see it so now I'm going to be taking my smaller brush. It's a, it's basically a fluffy brush from Morphe, the collaboration with Jeffree Star. And I'm just going to pack this brush just to remove any little product that was there. You want to make sure that you're doing it the right way because you don't want to mess up the ball. Now I'm going to be taking my LA Color Press Powder. 
this is my actual shade and I'm just gonna tap it in a little bit just to add a little bit more definition Fix a little bit. I think I messed up that a little bit here. Okay. So, um, the last thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna be taking our Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is um their ebony. It's a brow. Um, how do you call that? Um, like a mascara just to um correct any mistake that you have they have different shades so don't worry because we have different colors of brows so any colors of brows will get a different shade so. and to finish i'm gonna be taking my elf cosmetics lash they actually have two sides one which is the lash one and then the other one which is the brow i'm gonna be taking the brow gel this is the clear gel and i'm gonna be taking this just for the front part of my eyeballs because i like i like it to look natural so i'm just gonna play with it with the little hair can see it so this is the before that's the reason why i did one so you can see my eyeballs with the product the makeup and this is with nothing so this is everything i hope that you guys enjoyed this little tutorial and if you did please leave me a nice comment and if you have any suggestion on what to do any makeup related um topic i would be more than happy to answer you guys just leave them in the um description box below like where you can type and comment whatever you want and i hope that you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you did don't forget to share Comment, like, and subscribe to this channel, guys, so you can see more of these little videos. I love you guys so, so much, and thank you so much for watching.